I'm going to introduce you to Jack Doherty in real life. Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. So nice to meet you. I'm Casey. Uh, I'm Jack. Thank you for having us here today at your house. Thank you for coming to my house. Your car collection is incredible. Can you tell us a little bit about the cars here? This is the first Lamborghini I ever bought. It's a Lamborghini Huracan. And then this is my favorite Lamborghini. It's a Mansory kit Lamborghini. This so, is sick. Yeah, it's a SUV, so it has five seats. And then we have this McLaren. Is this real paint? Yeah, it's real paint. Uh, an, an artist in uh, Miami painted it. Other than this amazing car collection, is there another feature of this stunning mansion that you've got that would be your favorite? The horse barn in the back. You have a horse barn? Yeah, and I have like a little hockey set up in there. I have to see that. All right, let's go. Can we go check it out? Let's go. Let's do it. Okay, this is cool. Yeah, it's a horse barn, but I converted it to a little hockey rink, you know? You're obviously a fan of hockey. Yeah, I've been playing hockey like my whole life. Your whole life? Yeah. Wow, so you're obviously very good at it, so you need to show me how it's done because I don't think I've ever hit a coffee, what, co hockey, yeah, coffee, co coffee yeah, club. Close <laughs> enough, close enough. I'll show you how it's done. Show after. me how it's done. All I would right. love to see it. All right, ready? I would not want to be in the front of that. Your turn. No, okay. I I put your your bottom hand right here. Okay. Look. And then just just hit it. Just whack it? Yeah, yeah. Like that? Yeah. Like go? As hard as you can. Oh. Oh, close enough. Okay, so I know that this is all a lot of fun. You have so many amazing things you could do at your property, but I was thinking I could steal you for the day and take you skeet shooting. Let's do it. Have you ever done skeet shooting before? No. I thought we could do it off the back of a yacht. I don't even know, is that legal? I, apparently so, because I found somewhere to do it. We do have a departure time, so we've got to jump in the car and get going. Are you down? Yeah, that sounds like fun. All right, let's do it. Let's go. So, tell me, Jack, where are you originally from? At New York. Are you? Yeah. Wow, what brought you out to Miami? There's no state tax in Miami, so. We love that. We save a lot of money. Well, I feel like you've definitely created such an online presence for yourself. What's it like being such an online character? Like, do you feel like people might have the wrong perception of you? Yeah, definitely, because being on camera and off camera, and obviously you act different. Like, on camera, you have to watch out for everything you do, and sometimes you say the wrong things, do the wrong things, and you make mistakes, but, you know, you gotta learn from them. So what do you feel like has been one of the highlights of your career this far? So I've done a lot, but it's hard to like say what's bigger than the other. I know, I've met a lot of really cool people and filmed with a lot of like people I've always looked up to and um, I'm friends with a lot of like people I used to watch before I started and... Who's been one of the biggest ones that you've looked up to that you've got to meet? But Jake Paul was like a huge inspiration to me and like I've watched all his videos when I first started and like now we have each other's phone number and stuff and like we talk and like you know. That's awesome, congratulations. Oh no, it's cool going from watching them on a screen to like hanging out with them in person. Yeah, what, what are they like in person? Everyone's really cool, like I've never really not liked anyone I've met. I mean, some people, you know, obviously have like egos or whatever, and just like you can just see right through them, like they're kind of fake. But like, most of, like the really big guys that have something going on for themselves, like they're all really good, genuine people off camera. Because they all business minded. Like I'm, I'm sure you have so business minded and so structured in the way that you work too. If you've been doing it for so long, from such a young age, and then you don't just get success overnight. I'm sure there's a lot of YouTubers out there that don't have to hustle and work as hard as you do. Like it is a business at the end of the day, right? Yeah, exactly. You just gotta keep it going. I have a lot of people that like rely on me and... How many people do you have working for you? At this point, probably over like 50. 50 people? How do you yeah. keep up with all that? You have a team that helps yeah, you? Yeah, I have a team of people like that, you know, communicate with, help me communicate with my employees and everything. But I mean, there's still a lot of people that have to like talk to me on a day-to-day -day basis that I have to keep up with. And it's, it's a lot, it's overwhelming, it's exhausting, but... Damn, and you're still just getting started when you think about it. Like your life, you've still got so much life to live. Well, I think we're almost here for activity. I'm like nervous to see how this is gonna ha like work on a yacht. We yeah, shall see. Probably be harder than doing it on land. Yeah, I would think so, but you seem, seem like you're pretty sporty, so I reckon you've got this in the bag. Yeah, I got this in the bag. Sure. Yeah, you do. If you uh, put your mind to it, you can do anything. Ooh, here we go with some advice. I love that. Give us some wise words of wisdom. Some wise words of wisdom, all right? Yeah. Believe in yourself, invest in yourself. You can do anything that you set your mind to. Let life keep life in. All right, we got this. Let's do it. Welcome to 
your Yachts and Guns experience. Thank you. We're going to show you and give you a little bit of an explanation how this works. Any experience? I have shot a gun before. So a shotgun or a handgun? Yeah, a bit of both. A bit of both? Yeah. Okay, good. So, and then Jack? A little bit. Shot some guns before, you know? Okay, are you ready to take the first? Who's ready? I reckon you're up. Me? Yeah, All I right. believe in you. All right, yeah, let me show you yeah. how it's done. Can you show me how to do it? Oh, that was close, man. That was that close. Was super close. Get All it, right, Jack. Cool. Go. Oh. oh my God! You want more? This is the one. Pull. There it is. Get it. Ooh, so close again, my man. Close. Damn it. Zero's, zero's good. Zero's yeah, good. Zero, zero's that, zero's, zero's good. good. And that's good for me. Let's do this. Pull. You're gonna get it. Thank oh, gosh, you I know. You were really close. What's Actually, like? as close as he was. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear that? Pull! Almost did. It's hard. Who's your worst enemy? Think I about have enemies. it. All right, who's your best friend? I have a best friend. Okay, when you hit the target, she gets a million dollars. Oh, damn. All right? I get a million dollars. Pull! Oh. Uh. Almost there. Your turn. Yeah? yeah. We're gonna go 12 uh, yeah. gauge. I need, I, I need to get it. It's all on you. Let's go 12 gauge. Maybe it's the gun. See if it's the gun. He's gonna hit it like first try. Right. It's gonna show up. Pull. All right, man. It's the gun. Is it? Yeah. That was a practice gun. All right, show okay. us how it's done real quick. This is the gun. Give us some one. confidence. Pull. Damn. Damn. It's the That's right gun, time, right? I told you it was the right gun. Camera crew, ready? This is it. Is that hot? No, hold it for him. Just hold it. It's okay. Just hold it. Ah, hold it. Don't. Just kidding. <laughs> All right, yeah, this is, oh, I like this gun. Pull. I'm What's up? What's I'm, up? Yeah, let's go. I'm 100% accurate right now. <laughs> I told you. It was the gun all along. It was not you. Yeah, I knew I was good. I told you it was a gun. I was lucky. It's my good luck charm over there, huh? How much you betting? 100 bucks? All right, yeah, chef. We can do 100 bucks. All right, guys. So the competition is three and three. $100 on the table. Best out of three gets 100 bucks. Someone get this shit. I'm about to hit a bird. All right, best out of three. All right, pull. Too long. <laughs> oh, I was trying to hit the bird. Were you trying to go for a bird? I was. No. You ready to rock and roll? Yep. Pull. Get it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Pull. There it goes. Get it, Jack. Oh, right foot nice. it, Jack. Why did I say double? Uh, did you drink last night? Pull. There we go. Get it. Wow. That was the closest ever. <laughs> All right. This last one's yours. You know what it is? Yeah, it is. What is it? I needed to hold this for you. That's what it was. All right, this is the one. Roll. I believe in myself. This Ride is it. Roll. Ride and roll. Rock Ready. and roll. Do it. All right, pull. Yeah. No, that doesn't count. All right, all, all right, I right, so is that's it. One. You go. Ready? She's good. She's hot. All right, let's get these over with. I'm not trying he to lose He said it, money. not me. Okay. Rock this out. How was the experience? It was amazing. You crushed it. Fun, yeah. You, you really came it. through. You it's it. addicting when you when you hit it. I mean, there's a winner and there's a loser. 
But today, because both you guys did this, you're both winners. So oh. thank you for coming. All right, here we go. A little we something for you guys. Hold on, I got a little. Here's a little hat. There you go. Nice. Yachts and guns. Yachts yes. and guns. Thank you so much. That was amazing. You're thank welcome. you so much for thank you for joining us. Teaching really us your ways. It. Yeah, thank you. I had a lot of fun. I appreciate yeah. you. Do it again. Yeah. Do it thank again. You. You're do awesome. It. Thank Pleasure. you. Thank you so much. Thanks, right. guys. What do you say? We go grab a drink and relax a little bit. Yeah, I need to. Have a bit of a chat. I'm tired. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> So how did you find the skeet shooting off the yacht? I thought it was fun and very unique. You know, I didn't know you could shoot guns off a yacht, but... I had no idea. You got in a flow of it too. Once you got your first one, then you were just on a roll. Yeah, it, that was really fun. It was addicting, you know? Yeah, even though it was meant to be a competition, I definitely think that you won. I don't think it was a draw. I, I mean, feel like you got the most. You did get one round, you know? You beat me in a round. So I know you're quite the entrepreneur. You've been in the industry for almost a decade now. What kind of made you want to get started in the content creating space? When I was younger, like, everyone wanted to become a social media influencer influencer and I just stuck to it and I knew what I was doing. Here I am like 10 years later. I'm sure a lot of people have like misconceptions of how much work goes into the behind the scenes of coming up with the ideas and the content that you make. What kind of hours go into the work that you do? It's really non-stop like when I'm not filming, I'm planning when, when I'm gonna film next. Like I literally don't leave my house unless I'm filming. Like I literally dedicate my whole life to this stuff. Like I, if I'm live streaming, I live stream sometimes like 12 hours a day. And the next day I'll film like something like this where I'm just filming all day long. And then it's just constantly go, go, go. There's never breaks, you know? I did, I did see that you recently hit 10 million subscribers on YouTube. That's huge. How did that feel? Amazing. Like I remember when I was a couple years ago, I was like, dang, I don't think I'm ever going to get that 10 million subscriber black. And I was like 3 million subscribers. Fast forward to today, I'm at like 14 million. 14 million. Yeah, so definitely is worth it. It took me like eight years to get it, but it was, uh, it was a grind, it was a journey. What did that first million feel like compared to the 10 million? Like, does it, does, does, does it get more exciting or how does Not it Not really, I think the first million was definitely way more exciting than the 10 million. I did see that you're quite open about opening up about having ADHD, is that correct? Do you feel like that you can apply, you know, you're, you're always on the move and you have such an alert brain. Do you feel like that's why you like to keep yourself so busy? Yeah, like I never like to just do nothing. I'm always doing something, like something productive though. Like I don't like just wasting time or like doing random things for fun like the only reason i would do this today is if we're filming we're all getting something out of it it's fun you know i don't like just doing things for just to do it like i like doing it for videos and making content and just living life but filming it you know yeah so how what do you do in your spare time if you get any <laughs> think about what i'm gonna do uh, and i don't know you're always working huh yeah pretty much you need a lot of chill a little bit just a little bit <laughs> i don't like it. i get bored after chill no chilling for you minutes. so what's next for you in your busy life what have you got coming up in the future I don't know, just constantly just thinking of new ideas and trying to do big things, trying to change my persona as well online. Like a lot of people don't think I'm a great kid, but trying to do better things online and give back to people and just not be a little shit, you know? But I, I think I'm day. changing in a better way. I'm chill, I'm calm right now. I'm not a hypermaniac causing problems, you know? Yeah. We're, we're floating right now, the ship's not sinking. So I think I'm doing good. I'm excited to see what's coming next for you. You seem like such an amazing person. You've got a bright future ahead of you because you're still so young, but you're going so many places. So thank you so much for spending the day with us. We've really enjoyed having you on the show. Thank you so much for having me. This was a lot of fun. Of I appreciate course. It. Bye. Bye.